Hello everyone. So today we will learn how to create a quotation for any lead or for customers. So let's just go. Before going into it, let's uh, understand what is quotation. Quotation is basically an estimated cost of the product and service that we are offering to our potential uh, future customer or to our present customer. All right. So suppose there is a sales pitching going on, and during that, a customer might ask for the note about the product and service that we are planning to offer so they might want to know about all the estimated cost and what are the grand total and everything so for that we need to create a quotation all right now let's go to the new quotation and we can create quotation from there okay all right so quotation can be to lead and it can be to a customer so right now we have uh, leads in our system and since we are uh, studying the CRM section so let's go to the lead now I can select which lead do I want to send this particular quotation to so I'll select lead number five all right now the order type can be added such as sales is it the sales order is it the maintenance or shopping cart so right now it's sales so let's just keep it sales Alright, the next is see address and contact. So this is the address and contact of the lead that we have mentioned. And then we can um, the currency and the price list can be set uh, depending on the country that you are in. Alright, now in item we want to add the information about the item, their price and everything. Alright, so let's um, let's add item. Alright, now. I want to like suppose the price of an item is 650 all right keep it 650 and let's remove this row okay so we will be sending this particular invoice to a customer all right now let's go here from here you can mention the category of tax and then the shipping rule that um, your company follows and the next is sales taxes and charges so let's just add uh, some taxes on the total all right account head okay rate all right so this is um, after applying the taxes this is the total rounded total all right now the next is payment terms so payment term is basically indicates the term at which the payment has to be made okay so let's just add a row so this uh, i'm selecting the p3 term okay now you'll see the 100 over here so it basically means that a hundred percent payment has to be made all right so this is what it indicates if i'm selecting a 50 percent um, on delivery and then 50 percent on um, let's say uh, on booking advance then that will be different but this one is now it's set to 100 percent so now that will be the total all right now the next is the terms and condition that we can add and then next is the print setting uh, that means printing this particular invoice and then we can also add a more information about the campaign about the source and then we can also add the supplier quotation okay let's just save it okay now let's submit it yes okay now after submitting you will get these three options over here you can either create a new quotation or you can print this particular quotation or you can email it all right so let's just email this quotation to a lead all right so let's email it all right dear miss mulberry sabia here's the quotation thank you so yes and then we'll also select the language okay now let's just send it okay now the email has sent has been sent so now we can see that the email has been sent all right uh, it takes some minutes to send the email so that's why i have paused the video all right we'll check the email that has uh, that is received to us all right this is the email that i got and i also got the pdf 
of the invoice all right so this is the 708 grand total this is all that i got so this was about this was about the quotation um, uh, so we understood that what quotation contain it contains the receipt of the quotation and then it contains the items and quantities that we are offering and then it also contains the rate at which we are offering the taxes and then we can also in, uh, add other charges and then we can also add the validity of contract and the time of delivery and all other different things all right so i hope you understood this and thanks for watching